there are people here that, that understand what's happening, understand how to connect the dots, and are anxious to be helpful to people that need help uh, moving up their, the process of their projects or their endeavors. We've been the innovators. We've been in the investors. We've been the operator. We've been in your shoes, so we want to see things advance. They're a group that really gets behind management teams and helps them build out their business plan as if they were part of the company itself. We can understand how to deploy precious resources and multiply them and get results. And yes, there is a, a function of consultancy and advisory, but at the end of the day, what is a better description is the notion of partnership. Basically, for over 30 years, we have led the way. We have created new areas of gaming. We've created new jurisdictions of gaming. We've advanced emerging technologies. So first and foremost, we are innovators. We represent, to this day, over 100 of the top B2B and B2C brands in iGaming, sports betting, eSports, emerging technology around gambling, and we do it in the U.S. and from 11 countries around the world. There's not a region that we do not have a focus in, that we are not succeeding for our client relationships. <laughs> We take companies that are in different stages and we advance them to the next stage, whether it's through capital formation or business development or expanding to new jurisdictions. We're willing to spend some of our capital in terms of our integrity, in terms of our reputation, to scope out new technologies, to push the industry in directions that they seem, let's say, reticent to go. We believe in looking to the next generation of innovators and putting money behind them so that they can realize their dreams. When we connect our brand to other leading brands, it's a very powerful combination. So people like to be with us because they know that we have true grit here. They know that we do not quit. They know that we will get the job done and we will succeed more often than not. And people want to be associated with that. At the end of the day, we are partners. We look at ourselves forming long-term relationships with our clients, and we're looking to build value over the long-term as their partner. When we came to Vegas in 2000, nobody knew us here. We were below the radar screen. We weren't one of the original Vegas families. Some of the big names were still around, but but Las Vegas was going corporate. We came to downtown where Vegas started. We raised the capital behind the vision of redeveloping downtown Vegas. Fast forward, and a lot of our visions have come true. The same attitude, the same pioneer spirit that I found 30 years ago exists for how gaming is developing. The opportunity is there, and they should take their fair share of the marketplace. This is no different than the energy we felt the day we stood on Fremont Street in 2000 and said a lot of this is going to be ours pretty soon. The reason Las Vegas is a special place for me is because it is one of the last frontiers in America where you can have a dream, you can have a vision, 
And it doesn't matter what family you come from. It doesn't matter what your background is. You can make it happen in Las Vegas. There's not many places left, frankly, in the world where that's the case. The gaming business is uh, one of expansion. It actually is poised to grow more so than it has over the last 30 years, just in the time in front of us. So at the rate that we've seen in the U.S. with over 30 jurisdictions approving some form of online gaming, sports betting, esports, uh, peer-to-peer competition, skill-based gaming is unprecedented. We're building a young team here. We're looking at the next 30 years. We're energetic. We're poised because it's really just starting to take off in a way we've never seen before.